guys, today I have something very special for you. I have Google Now. So let's get started. So to access Google Now, press and hold the search key on my Droid Razor Max and it pops up Google Now. You have different cards on here which show you different information. 13 minutes to home, that's the traffic info and a bunch of other stuff such as weather so you can ask, ask it many different questions and when you at, when you have a card in here the cards also pop up in your notifications uh, I don't think yeah you can't swipe double swipe down on them but they do pop up in the notifications telling you what the weather's like and it also does uh, voice commands so you can say Google launch cal calculator and that, I messed that up opening app. I guess it's opening that so Google launch calculator It takes a while for it to load, but it'll open the app. And then you can also ask it, how did the Eagles do? The Eagles lost to the Redskins 27 to 20. So that was pretty bad, but that works too. You can check up on your sports scores. You can also uh, ask the weather. What is the weather like in New York City? So there you go. And we can go back, back, back. And there we are at our start screen. To swipe away the cards if you don't want them anymore, just swipe them left or right, just like the notifications. And you can also swipe away the notification for the card. When you tap on it, it brings up Google Now. So whatever application you're in, if you swipe down the notifications and tap on it, it will bring you straight to Google Now. On many different devices, you can access Google Now by pressing the on uh, the on-screen nav buttons. Press the on-screen home button and swipe up, and you can get to Google Now that way. On uh, my Samsung Galaxy S3, press and hold the home button, and Google Now pops up in there. And that is pretty much it for Google Now. Um, it's a great voice assistant kind of like Siri, but it does get faster in search results because it's using Google servers.